Hello everyone. This time I want to show you guys how to give other people access to one people one person's one drive. And also we can set up the one drive to bigger inside, large inside. Normally when you assign the Office 365 E3 or E5 license, the default you know the one drive size is one terabyte. But we can set up to 5 terabyte if we want let's uh, see how can we do this normally if we go to the user you see this user has already got an e5 license we click this user and then we click one drive if we click edit in the storage used so the default is you know same as organization default limit per user is uh, one terabyte it's uh, one zero two four gigabyte but we can select the other one like maximum storage for this user i change it to five terabyte so i click save So this one is safe now. So you see the user storage is you is now changed to five terabyte. So the other one I want to show you is how to give other people access to one user's one drive. Normally, you know, for example, if the user has left the company and other people wants to access this user's one drive, what we can do is we can go to this one drive tab again and we click create link to files and then we click this link then we open the user's one drive and uh, if we want to give other people access to this user's one drive we can click this gear button on the top right and click one drive settings then we click more settings there's a site collection administrators so currently you know the administrator and the user himself has uh, access to the one drive but we can add other people like we wanted to give David give David Smith access to this user's one drive we add this user in and then click OK so after we give this user permission then uh, we can give this you know one drive link to David Smith and tell him to access Joseph Smith's one drive from this link because we have already added him to the administrator then we can just uh, let's double check this one joseph d is the uh, grand permission Go to permissions and grant permission, then add David me to the permission. So we see I have added David me to the permission for the one drop. Then you know one David should have the access to Joseph's one drive now. Just give them the access. Give this one. Then David should be able to access Joseph's one drive. Thank you. Thanks.